Greetings faculty and welcome to another technology tutorial. In today's lesson, I'm going to demonstrate uh, the use of Google Spreadsheets as a means of keeping track of grades. Uh, now, a couple of days ago, I stumbled upon uh, this blog post of a guy who successfully created a gradebook in Google Spreadsheets uh, based on a, an, Excel, uh, an Excel sheet template, um, which then allows students to actually view their grades in real time. So basically what's happening is um, if the student is signed into their Google Apps account, they can click on a link which will take them to their current grade in that class. And I just want to kind of, I've actually worked with this idea a bit and sort of set it up to kind of look a little bit like what this would be at our school. Um, so the first thing is, is having downloaded a gradebook template. There's lots of these. I just happened to pick one that allowed to have a weighted grades. Um, and all of this can be customized to kind of meet the needs for your class. And these templates are often available at this place, uh, Vertex 42. Um, so this will save you a lot of work because a lot of the formulas are already built into the spreadsheet. Um, so I've been playing with this one a bit. Um, I've added uh, to the master list some some students, and then I've also adapted the grading scale um, to kind of match our gr one through seven, our seven point system versus the A B C D F system. And I added, of course, percentage points for the different types of categories of homework, um, and fiddled with that some. And then I created this new sheet all together. And what this is, is basically it's gathering all of the data and putting it into individual columns, which can then generate reports per student. So that's why there's vertical columns per student. Um, it's a simple, this is the, the, the tran transpose uh, function in Google Spreadsheets um, that, make this, that makes this possible. So to kind of see this in action, um, you know, it works like any other grade book. I can you know, add students here. So for example, I'll just put my name here. I haven't yet figured out the use of this ID. Uh, I just, I'm not really using it, but I'll give a student ID. And then I can just put in email address. And at this point, you can see I've been added here to the gradebook. Um, and then I would just simply add grades. And I could even define these assignments a little bit better. But right now, I'm just using what was given via the template. All right, so I'm going to erase me as a student. So now on to the interesting part. So right now. I have three students in this class. Um, and if I were to add another assignment in here, I would simply, um, if I wanted to be graded, I would put an X right here. So this is basically telling the script that, okay, yes, consider this in the final grade. And now I know this assignment is out of 50 points, so I'm just gonna plop in some random numbers here. And towards the right, you should see how maybe this grade will alter a little bit. So there. So that's this is sort of the behind this is the grade book that the kids don't see. This is just the teacher managing. Um, and this is just some data on, on the class in terms of grades. But what's interesting for the students, like, like I said at the beginning of this video, is if the student is logged into their Google Apps account. So for example, I'm logged in here as John Adams. If I go now to a Moodle class and I click on the link that my teacher has posted, it's gonna give me a report of just my grades. So if I click on this, because I'm logged in as John Adams, it will deliver a report of John Adams and he can see how he's doing 
in the class. So I just think this is kind of a very interesting way to use Google Spreadsheets. Um, it does take some customization and some playing around with numbers. And but I think once you have it set up, um, it's pretty robust and you can get some good data um, out of your great book. And again, because it's outside of, of the LMS, um, out of Moodle, for example, or anything else, you don't have to learn a new system each time uh, your school changes perhaps uh, their virtual learning environments or so on and so forth. So it's, it's kind of, it remains in Google Spreadsheets and is yet accessible um, to students if you'd like. So, and the script is actually, uh, I, I believe I posted it here on, on this sheet, although I guess it applies to the whole spreadsheet, um, but I could go into the script editor. And this was literally a, a copy paste with the only difference was I had to add the key, my spreadsheet key right here, which allowed the script to work with my spreadsheet. So that's pretty much it. Just a, an interesting way to use a Google spreadsheet as a full fledged grade book um, that is accessible to students at any time during the day. Thanks for watching.